So update on Bob. Uh, today is painting day. We've been waiting for a warm day to try to get some paint done. Uh, did a lot of sandblasting yesterday. You can see the oil pan is primered and that's ready for paint. Uh, the engine bay has been mostly stripped. Uh, I have a little bit of primer on here, but the plan today is to primer the rest of it, get it all nice and straight, and then paint most of it. I'll probably leave the back third um, unpainted until I can get everything masked off. That's going to be the harder part because I'm not taking all of the brake lines and stuff off. Um, you can see that I've already painted some parts. There's uh, hinges hanging here and the fan is hanging there waiting for paint. The hinges are done. Um, I want to get the oil pan on the block today so that I can um, paint it all at once. I'm going to paint everything black once the oil pan's on and the block is pretty much ready to go. So hopefully I can get to that today. We'll see how it goes and then I'll show you some more parts out front. So this is the other stuff that we sandblasted. Uh, this all gets blue, Ford blue paint. Uh, and then on the end is the exhaust manifold. We had that, I sandblasted that and then we coated it yesterday. It gets one more coat of exhaust paint today and that should be ready to go. And hopefully we get all this stuff sprayed today and I will give you an update later, see how it goes. <music> And lots of painting today getting pulled six different directions we had so many things trying to get painted we had a nice warm day which is kind of what we were waiting for so I got about half of the engine bay up to about the shock towers the front half of the shock tower is done um, I did the braces and then I still have to do all the back side but this is all pretty much done a couple touch-up spots I think I missed a couple spots that I just noticed um, this is a paint that we're using it's a Krylon 1613 uh, this is an industrial grade uh, it's something that Mustang guys use on the engine bay, so it's got the right sheen, kind of an eggshell finish. Um, kind of hard to find. Um, they do make a commercial version, but it's not the same formula, so trying this. It came out really good, I think. Um, looks just about right. And then we also did the engine and got that painted we flipped it over and put the oil pan on that was a little bit of a challenge um, and then sprayed the block from the other side and then flipped the whole thing over again and finished the top side the uh, valve cover is just set on there for now i still want to do the valves and adjust the valves before i close everything up but that got all painted today the air cleaner got painted a bunch of other bits got painted so we're getting close uh, a lot of cleanup Still to do on various parts before we put it back and then we got to try to stab the motor so uh, i got to finish the rest of the engine bay and then hopefully maybe next weekend maybe sunday we can try the motor or might have to wait a week beyond that we'll see uh, that's the engine paint that we're using on the engine just high temp uh, engine paint it's ford color but it's black so it's not a big deal so, so that's where we're at and uh keep posted and uh like the channel